Drones are becoming more advanced every day, and they're proving critical for a variety of applications. And if you think one drone is useful, imagine what an entire fleet could accomplish. Welcome to the Drone Revolution. From Mauser's final project of 2016, we're designing a fleet of connected drones. It's called Project First Responders, and it's sponsored by Intel and TE Connectivity. In order to control multiple drones at the same time and harness their collective power, we need a communications platform. And to help us with that, we have Ivan Stamatovsky. Tell me all about Global Arc. Global Arc is a platform that we built that enables peer-to-peer -peer communication between autonomous vehicles. So they relay information to each other and thus extend their range. And it allows one person or multiple people to control one or multiple drones. For example, the Coast Guard could employ various drones for search and rescue, or the system could be very useful during the aftermath of natural disasters like hurricanes and earthquakes. There are also commercial applications like monitoring or surveillance. Now what types of components are you using in these drones? We use barometers to tell us the altitude. They have to know where they are in space, so we use some uh, GPS on board. There are thermal sensors and others that we can collect data from. Now for this project, we have a public safety application in mind, fighting forest fires. Often with fighting forest fires, it's about having police and fire work together with their drone networks. Specifically, you can have different agencies in the field using different modules. If you think of firefighters as first responders, this would be your zero response. We have the infrared actually showing them where people are on the ground. <laughs> that is super cool. And the police can have a high resolution camera. If you have a dangerous situation like this, you can send in the drones. So it keeps people out of harm's way. Ivan, is it possible for one drone to send information to the other? Absolutely. They can communicate to each other to unlimited distances. Over the next two episodes, we'll be completing the drones and working with local government agencies for a simulation. Stay tuned for more as Mauser pushes the boundaries of drone technology 